crazy type shit, man. Check it out, though. Tell you about some more crazy type shit, you know? What it do, what it do, what it do. I'ma tell you what it didn't do. It didn't do it. Straight up. What it do has been a good. You know? That's what it come down to. You know what I mean? You thought you had some fire. You thought you had some fire. You thought you had some power. You understand? You thought you had some power. Doing all that dumb shit that you do, you know? And I'm forced to tell you about that dumb shit, you know what I mean? Because how long are you going to continue to do the dumb shit? I mean, you know, how, how long? Question. How long are you going to continue to be proving that you absolutely are not thinking? That you absolutely don't even need to have a brain, you know? Um, projecting... Stupidity, ignorance, no elevation, just, I don't know. I mean, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, you you tell me after, after I deliberate and show you how aggravated you must become with, with no one else but you. You. Right. All right. Let's start it out like this here. All right. See, a lot of you probably sitting back right now. And I took the time for you to consider what I'm about to say. Is that to say, this dude crazy as hell. Fuck is all this and shit. You know, who the fuck you think he is? I told you before, I am God. That's who I think I am. That's who I know I am. Okay? And that's who I know you are too. And nevertheless, I told you. Who do we think he is? Okay. Who do you think you are? You think you're human? You think you're human, correct? All right. I know. You do human things. All right. You do human things. But you were told that that which is flesh is flesh and that which is spirit is spirit. I am in this world, but not of this world. You human, though. All right, let me just show you how what humans do. Humans do some dumb shit without thinking at all. You know, they, they just do some dumb shit. Just like uh, always trying to fit in. You know, that's about the dumbest shit that one can even think to do. You know, the masses is always the lead and... The led astray ones. Not only that, man. You fit into these pants hanging down, right? You know, you fit into it. Oh, that's what they're doing today. The masses. That's what they're doing today. So instead of you thinking for your damn self, you let the masses, that's guided by the mass tours, tell his slave what he should do. Matter of fact, I'm going to tell him when he should celebrate all throughout the goddamn year. And I'm going to also make those times of celebration, I'm going to make them the same times as we have our annual rituals of baby eating, 
the flesh of humans being ate. We also gonna set our altars up to kill the babies and the sacrifices on certain days. And we're gonna regulate them and project them through a hologram called a holiday on a holodeck in your fucking head. And this is how we're gonna accomplish our energy leaving the earth. Because on the same day that they do Thanksgiving, we will be eating the Moors, the Moors, the black folk, you. We gonna be eating they ass, okay? And not me. Understand who's speaking in, in the tent, in the tents. <laughs> Straighten it out. Nevertheless, they gonna be eating our so-called ass, real Moors, real Turks. You gonna be sitting at your table eating turkey, brown golden, melanated brothers, ancestors, sisters. They tricked you to do the worship and to participate in the ritual all throughout the year, hunting for eggs. It's energy there, but nevertheless, it's energy there. And all that energy around the globe, guess what? Comes together on these days. Participation in a ritual on the days that they killed your people. On the solistics. You have no thought about what to do on the 21st through the 24th. Those are some strong points. Very important points for you to understand. You're supposed to be going in. Inside of self on this time. Because the earth, without getting too technical for you, the earth at the winter solstice is down here. All right? It's down here. And it's about to raise up this way. All right? It's coming this way. So it's at the maximum gravitation. So it's pulling all the energy from the earth through the sun up. Okay? It's pulling it up. You know what energy you sent off? While it's pulling it up, you send off to the energy field, to the energetic body of the cosmos, you send off a frequency that states that you are in full participation of the ritual satanic um, festivities because you're eating that meat. We are not meat eaters. Meats have spirits. Meats have spirits because they were animals. Animals have spirits. You're eating the spirits of animals. They have found out how to, yes, put in entities in the meat. The cow is being fed what? It's being fed GMO constructed food. So now you have a different entity in your cow that you eat. So now you have a different spirit other than what you think you're eating in your ass. Without any knowledge. And you were told not to eat meat. Don't eat meat. You're spiritually possessed now. That's not your thinking. You will never see a car load of vegans do a drive-by. You do it because you eat robotic chicken. You eat robotic with codes not from the animal itself, but also artificial intelligent codes. DNA spiraling backwards. All different types of things. Programs. You remember the Matrix when that girl was eating that piece of cake and the, and the white Anglo-Saxon looking one um, stated, um, I developed that program. Look at her. She ate the chocolate mousse-like type cake with some white filling on the top or some shit like that. And, 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 and the counter went between her legs and it, seen, it showed a cosmic type of um, um, uh, graphics and dynamics that was moving throughout the body in an orgasmic cosmic relation. And what did they always say about chocolate? You know, sexual content and things like that. It was programmed into it. So now they're with the with the GMO, they're programming the meat. You have their demons in your ass. You remember when Jesus um, set out the uh, um, 
took the spirits out of the evil man and put them into what? The pigs. They went into the pigs, the meat. It was the meat. That was a, a, a metaphysical process, an alchemical process that was known how to send demons into the meat and for your ass to eat. It was right there before you. You eat that meat, you participate in the rituals. More people have told you this. You need to stop eating meat. You, you, you're worried about looking different if you stop eating meat. Well, I'm going to tell you something. If you knew how you would be by eating life, by eating vegetables, plants, uh, fruits, herbs, spices, only, you get, see, your body, listen, your body gets the most energy from any substance that it doesn't have to uh, 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 process. Um, vegetables, raw vegetables, not cooked vegetables. You cook it, you cook, the, uh, what's rising up out of it is, it, you see steam. So what is that telling you? Something is leaving. Something has, something is in the process of leaving and it is the most essential gentle elements because you have it, got it in heat. It must go. And then you think you're eating something. You're not eating anything. And you're definitely not eating anything when you eat chocolate chip cookies. Ho-Ho's, Ding Dong's, stupid ass Frito-Lay's and, and Dutch cookies and, and all this type of stuff. You, you, you think you're eating something. I'm going to tell you what you're eating. First of all, <clears throat> anything that's processed, anything that's made like Duncan Hines, that is a, a is the board of Duncan Hines is a sorcerer. It's a round table of sorcerers with a, with a model. Okay? That is not food. That is cooked and created in the laboratory with chemicals. Chemicals have side effects. In order to create a certain side effect, they, they uh, uh, mix certain chemicals to get a certain side effect into the organism in which it is digested. And they call it a ho-ho. It might be a hint. It might be a hint hint for the ho-ho's eaters. <laughs> Nevertheless, do you understand? Even in the Matrix, we, when uh, the one, Neo, when he took the pill, when he sat down in the chair after taking that pill, okay? Morpheus said, what did he say? He said, uh, that pill that you took was a part of a tracer program to disrupt your input and output character waves. Listen, that pill that you took was a, dis a part of a disruptor program created to disrupt your inputs and outputs, your input frequency and your output frequency, meaning controlling, binding your ass to submission to what it can, and you're not letting out no frequency. So it just took a pulsating frequency that was animating to the universe like this, throwing energy to the universe, receiving energy back, right? This is you regular. So you take a chemical, and it goes like this. Doop. Just like that, all right? It disrupts your input and output carrier waves. You are atoms. You are voids. You are this. Your atoms look like this. Hold on. Lungs of the baby or whatever. To M. Uh, to disrupt your input and output carrier carrier waves. You are this. This is the, the nucleus of an atom. This is the electron. This is you. Naturally. In the energetic field, this is you. I'm just giving you the slow realization of it. You take a pill, a capsule, a Tylenol, an Advil, okay? A Ding Dong, a Hershey's. Some Frito-Lay chips. They talking about implanting chips in people? You're eating them. You're eating the chips. My, nanotechnology. You're eating the chips. They're in the cookies. You know when uh, you, uh, you put, uh, check this out. Take some cereal and put it in a bowl of water. Just put about five or seven different 
pieces of um, cereal in a bowl of water. Take a scroll magnet and watch the damn cereal after, after the cereal has absorbed some water, all right? Let them absorb water. Let them get fully wet. They'll be floating on the top. It'll follow the magnet. Why? Because it has metal in it, small nanotechnology in it. You're eating this shit. You're thinking, you're processing, these are your thoughts you're getting in your head. They're not your thoughts. It's due to the food you eat. People are going to jail because of something they thought about their, their, their uh, current situation and handle it in a manner in which five minutes later they'll say, I don't know why I did that. I, I know what I should have did. But that's when you're in the backseat of so-called pig police car. Right? Agency. Central. Headed. And notified. Then it's too late. You know? But what, what made you do that? Huh? If you, you think vegans is sitting around talking about who they gonna rob? You think vegans and people who practice Tai Chi, no meat eaters, but vegans and people who practice Tai Chi and no self is sitting there uh, uh, overcrowded in the um, crap house or at the weed spot. You use so much of your energy, man, for, for no apparent fucking purpose, man. None. I'm going to give it to you just like that. You know what I'm saying? You use your energy for a no apparent motherfucking purpose. Look, you take a Chinese man, all right? 25 years old, 22 years old. You take a 22-year-old so-called African-American. I didn't shake my head because of speaking on him. I shook my head in a manner because I don't want to say African. Because African is, it just shows you use a stupid, stupid, super stupid motherfucker by saying that. And, but we understand. But now you understand. See, here it is. Africa was founded by Africanists or whatever. White dude, right? European slave master. Last name was Africa. He called the land Africa. And called the people on that land, his land, African. So every time you say you are African, you say you are a slave. And I accept the master's name for my whole land. That's what you say. That's what you admit to, to the conscious, wise owl, old owl. That's what you say to him. You don't even cross it out on, on the application. Start crossing that shit out. Put more. M-U-U-R. When it says other, put more. And if it don't have a slot that says other, make one. Make one. Now, you do the stupidest shit. I forgot what I was at, but you do some, we, us, do some stupid shit, man. These, the, the holidays, you know, forgot exactly where I was at. And for me trying to reach out to you and saying, can you help me and remind me to where the fuck I was at? That'll be just like you doing and calling on any motherfucking body else. Because you can't help me and tell me where the fuck I was at. Self-savior. Save your goddamn self. And all, when you fall into the frequency of pity, oh man, I just don't know what to do. How did you know? You just some weak shit. Don't ever do that shit. That's a program. That's a program. And you're following it out. I have no remorse for a, a weak a frequency like that. You know what I'm saying? When I see it, I crush that shit. So when it come up, to, up on me, I crush that shit. You know why? Because see, the heart is more powerful than the mind. The heart is way more powerful than the mind. Matter of fact, it's a, I heard some people say a hundred times more powerful. Then I heard some people say a billion times more powerful than the mind. All right? Your heart. You know, it, it's so much stuff I want to say to you, man. My, my mind is going like, like the Tesla coil. It's going everywhere. I'm, I'm, I'm moving at warp speed. I got so much to say about your, your, uh, us as a uh, so-called people, you know. And don't get don't get too tripped out on the, on 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 the, on the unifying. People get all discouraged about that. See, first of all, you don't supposed to be outside of yourself. Unify your goddamn self, okay? First of all, you know what I'm saying. Don't worry about no motherfucker about else. The instructions was know thyself. So unify thyself, then. 
Don't worry about them. You following illusions out there. They cannot help you. I just asked you in thought to help me find out where the fuck I was at. You can't help me. Shut the fuck up. Don't, and they don't need to think I can. This weak shit. You know, like, uh, a lot of people are like, you know, well, that's what I had to do. But you, what? You following the program that you seen on TV that thought, that formed your thought patterns in your head by you watching dumb shit on TV. You should have been cut the TV off. Been cut the TV off. Don't watch it on damn TV. TV, what is that doing for you, man? You, you know, oh, back to what I was saying about the uh, Chinese man and the black man, right? At uh, 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 21 years old, all right? Give him $700. Give him $7 million a piece. Seven million dollars a piece. We got a uh, black man, so-called, and we have a, a uh, and we have a uh, Chinese man, right? Okay, Chinese man and black man. Seven million dollars a piece. You know what that Chinese man gonna do at twenty-one? He's gonna if he is if he hasn't been to college. He's going to go to college, learn exactly the trade he wants to do, and the production company or whatever the fuck it is. Let's just say he was a, um, let's say he was a, um, a, a stone cutter, a mason, carpenter. Um, he liked plants or some shit. All right? You know what he's going to do? He's going to go to school, learn the trade, and start a business and employ his family and send money back to China with that five or seven million dollars. That's what he's gonna do. You know what the black, so-called African is gonna do? The slave, he's gonna buy a nice car with some dumbass rims on it, a couple houses, throw a large party every motherfucking night until his money run out in a year. That's what he's gonna do with it. This is the shit that you be thinking. This is the shit. What? Uh, let, me, let, me, let me show you something. I probably can't show it to you. Damn. Let me show you something. This is this this is what you like. This this is what I I don't um see. See, I got the ability now to know that the dimensions are all merged together. These dimensions are all merged together. You know what I mean? If you can step back up out of either one of them, you will see them. But while you're in them, you'll never see them. You'll never see them. You'll never see them. They hide, but they're right in front of your face. Check this out. This is what you like. This is what you glorify. They made a video for your ass. Looking at it now, you're seeing that dimension, right? All right? You see that dimension now. You really down for it? being 2014, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, coming out on the end of this type of shit? You want to come out on the end of this? What is what? You've been through them roads. You've been through them roads. You've been down them streets. You've been at that track meet. You've been at that swap party. You've been at that shit. Just like in the Matrix, when he was trying to jump out the car. You've been down them roads. You know these roads. You know what? You know these roads. You know these roads. What the fuck is you doing? Why are you listening to music and Looking at TV and, and these things that show you getting killed and 
shooting up other people and disrespecting everybody and your mama. You know, homosexuality and all of them are actors. All of them, you know what I mean? Because that's the way they got down. That's the way your ass was going to have to get down if you sign this contract. You do what? You party like we party. Party like a rock star. Shit. I like to look up the so-called etymology of rock and put it together with stars and see exactly what the fuck they metaphysically fucking saying, you heard? But nevertheless, you already know this, and if you don't know they all motherfucking butt buddies, you, you, about, you need to just hit gay butt buddies or some shit and, and be amazed on YouTube. Nevertheless, man, the black dude, Negro, the one who always trying to fit in, you know? Uh, you might say this look crazy. See, I ain't trying to fit in with you motherfucking ass because you motherfuckers ain't learned yet that the more you try to fit in is the more you don't stand out. And who want to live their life, one of their lives, not being remembered for shit because he didn't stand out. He made no motherfucking effort to do what was right or stand with the truth. He made no effort. He did absolutely jack. Actually. You know? And I'm not saying I'm trying to do a lot. I know what not to do now. That's all I'm saying. And so they gave me direction. And that's why you're listening to me right now. And that's why you need to switch gears too. Switch gears, man. You know, they got a mandate out there. For the cops and all these DEA and FBI and all this shit. They got a mandate to shoot your black ass right down. You know, they, they ain't got to worry about no, no. That's why they, that's why they getting re -quitted. But they hoping you gonna uh, uh, retaliate in a manner that causes um, um, the city get, to get locked down. You know, or have a riot. That's what they hoping your ass do. See, some of these things don't even happen. And, and, and the best advice about all that TV shit, don't watch it. Don't go for the news. Don't read the newspaper. You can't change it. See, if you accept it in your head all the time, you got to understand this and totally understand this. You know how we eat food? We eat the food, right? Our body is digesting the food. You eat an apple, you get what it brings in, right? Boom. You know what I'm saying? It's digested and defecate the rest out. It's screaming. Boom. Right? Now, but your mind is doing the same damn thing. It's digesting continuously. Continuously digesting what you see, hear, creating what you're thinking. See what I'm saying? And their objective is to make you fear. Make you fear. Because that energy leaving the planet helps them out. It helps them out. But if you cut that shit off, cut it off, you don't want to hear, you don't want to hear no negative nothing. You ever heard this monkey, see monkey doing all, I mean monkey... You know, you see the monkeys like this? Well, they just telling you right there. Don't see the evil. Don't hear the evil. Or we gonna change evil into negativity. Or, better yet, we gonna say fear. Hmm. No. Better yet. It's only two. It is only two commands issuing out the heart. You have the left side and the right side. The right side and the left side. Alright? Alright. And they're noted for colors, right? Red and blue. The red draws in. The blue pushes out. All right. Now remember the colors and remember its properties. One draws in, which is red. So when you see red energy coming towards you, energy is entering you. When you see blue energy move away from you, energy is leaving you. All right. So that's that's what you could do sometimes when you when you're um hovering over water or or, or, or you know energizing something. Those are the colors. If you want to take something out, you understand to use blue. If you want to put something in. You understand to use red, but you also understand red goes counterclockwise. Because it spins, no, no, excuse me. It draws um, the appropriate radiation, so it draws in, it spins in. And the blue will spin out. 
All right. So, anyway, that's so once again a lot of energy going everywhere. As you, as you can see with my hair going everywhere. Got some copper up in there and some silver up in there. So I'm receiving. You heard? Check this out. Um, so much I want to say. Okay, let me just get back to this. You want to fit in so much, right? You want to fit in. He wants to fit in. And, 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 and you keep, you, you hold a frequency like uh, like this. You hold a frequency like this. Because y'all, a lot of y'all be like, y'all, you talk kind of, you know, whatever. And, uh, you know, but y'all hold y'all, you know, composures and shit, you know. Try to be, hey, you know, and, uh, you know, and, you know, coming out of this box. You heard? I mean, you created it, but uh, congratulations. Fuck yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> anyway, you caught up on shit like that. But see, even the 48 laws of power in the back, the 48th law said be formless. Be formless. See, you shouldn't want to hold a frequency of toughness all the time. And then when it comes time to really be tough, you, you don't know how to act. <laughs> um, water. Be formless, like water. Like Bruce Lee said, be water, my friend. You know? Water is formless. It flows. It can become anything once it's put into a container that defines the shape that the water becomes. You see what I'm saying? So, a lot of people are like, oh, he don't sound too tough. Nigga, check it out. When it's time to get, when 7 o'clock come, believe me, it will be 7 o'clock. And I will be Tai Chi down, motherfucker. You heard? Nevertheless, do I, why do I need to propagate that shit all the time? Or why do I have to act like any goddamn thing all the time? When your mind and your body is changing. But you have decided to, to seek a form. When the 48 law said, be formless. When Bruce Lee said, be water. Okay? And water, you are how much? 98% or 78%? Or whatever the fuck you agree to, you are a large portion of it, but you want to steal the waters and put it in a, a, a goon motherfucking bag. And you want to be a goon. Why you want to be a goon? You want to be a gorilla. A gorilla. 2014, 15, 16, 17, 18. You are a gorilla. Your people is not advancing. And it don't matter about the advancement. See, you must advance here. You keep blocking on to the people. See, first of all, people can't help you. You can only help yourself. And you can make shit like this and get the truth out. You heard? You know? Make shit like this. Don't go twerk it out. Nigga. Nah, I'm talking about you homosexuals. <laughs> Not only you. Anyone who perceived that, you know what I'm saying? It don't make sense, man. You, you're participating and letting the world see you as not worthy of life. So if such an event, and you wonder why they even call a national crisis up on your dumb asses. You know, you say, no, that's just this, 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 this. Well, let me see this. If you're watching TV, mm -mm. if you're watching TV, right, and you see a Chinese dude, and he looks slightly like Jet Li. And you say, oh shit, it's going to be some kung fu in this motherfucker. It's going to be some fighting up in that motherfucker. But how many Chinese you know, nigga? How many Chinese you know? Do you? Damn. How the fuck then do you know? Because the TV showed you that shit. Right? That's what they showed your ass. So flip it. Flip mode. What do you think that Chinese thinking about your ass? When he don't have no friends like your ass. And he see your ass at, you know what? Pimping this woman, selling drugs, fucking up the community, not owning shit, you know what I'm saying? Not saving their money. The churches is stealing from them. The churches, the political people can't do shit because they rely on a system that will refuse you. All avenues have been closed and controlled. So it only leaves self. Go in, motherfucker. And then connect with people to go in and start up a unity. 
just through networking, just knowing each other. You're going to provide a service because now you know you cannot be a slave. Sovereign says, I work for no one and have no contract with no one. That means whatever you get in these so-called notes while they're still available, <laughs> you know, these so-called FRNs, these uh, 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 Federal Reserve notes, uh, IOU, 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 motherfucker. You owe me then, motherfucker. Yeah. Nevertheless, you network and you do not use money between each other. You trade. You use the money that you make in order to create your business. Whatever your passion is, use and only stay away from the TV, stay away from the news, stay away from the, uh, 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 the paper, stay away from dumbass motherfuckers. Cut on YouTube and go to the God channels. You understand? Go to the God channels, the, the high supreme frequencies, the shit that releases the, 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 the fear. And fear not. There's nothing to fear. It's not even fear to, it's that fear itself, bullshit. No such thing. But it is fear. But it's no such thing. You heard that? Two dimensional, three dimensional, four dimensional, five. Nevertheless, check this out. The heart only animates two frequencies. And one is the illusional fear. But it becomes real. And one is the illusional love. But it becomes real. You understand? Check it out. So, it means when your heart being the strongest energy, somebody jumped up on you and said, boom, motherfucker. Your heart is going to go, ah, you know what I'm saying? And it might shut your ass down, according to how it happened, right? Agree? Okay, boom. You can fall off something in your sleep. Your heart don't know the difference. If your thought could save your ass, your thought would, but it can't. And they say if you hit the ground in a sleep, you could die and have a heart attack. Why? Because your heart knows not the difference, okay? So nevertheless, it's, it's two energy pulses that pulsates and we went through the color red and green I mean red and blue all right I'm not gonna rewind but you understand you understand and understand check it out so the frequencies is love and fear so it's only two it's, it's no pride it's no dignity motherfucker it's only cultural continuity see you're divided with dignity and pride and stupid shit like that pride with who my people, yo, your people is the illusion. It's you that count, motherfucker. You, you, and people who look like you, people who think like you, people who do like you, don't fit in with this shit trying to fit in and comfort. I'm trying to be this. You know what I'm saying? That thought pattern is, is for lames and for people who have no goddamn aim. You're, that's what it's for. All right? You're intelligent in that. All right? And if you wasn't, now you are. Check it out. So, I'm going to make this quick, though, okay? But nevertheless, what we're going to do is, um, you got two frequencies, all right? The high frequency, which is the love, and the low frequency, which is the, um, the fear, all right? I, I got a camera here, so I don't have to look. I mean, I, I let them do it. I got cameras outside the house, so nevertheless. Nevertheless, I own a business. Anyway, um, so the higher frequency is the love, and the lower frequency is the fear. All right, it's only two pulses that comes out of your ass. That's it. So you got to learn to transmute them. Whenever the fear comes, whenever the fear comes, you got to change it to love. But the best way to do it is to change it in like arousal. Now, here's the key about arousal. A lot of people are like, what you talking about? I'm talking that metaphysical, right on point, right in exact, pay attention type shit. Did. All right. So, you turn into arousal. You know how when a person, you know, might be saying something, you know, you might be in a, let's just say, let's make a scenario. You might be in a room or something, and you, it might be several people in there. You ain't got nothing to do with nobody but the person who's in front of you. And these people over there talking crazy in the motherfucker or whatever, and you get a feeling like um, you should leave. Well, actually, you should leave, motherfucker. But nevertheless, that ain't what I'm getting at. Let's just switch it just a little bit. You, um, you know, something, you hearing somebody talking about you or whatever. You know what I'm saying? And they're talking about you, and you picking it up. And you kind of get a fear, because it's only you. You might not know this motherfucker that you're talking to, and it looks like he got nine motherfuckers with him. Nevertheless, see... It's only two frequencies. You got to switch that shit. 
The easiest way, switch it to arousal. You know how you uh, motherfuckers say, yeah, that motherfucker talking that shit making my dick hard. Now check this out. That sounds stupid though, right? And it sounds like, you know, it's just something to say. But metaphysically, that's how you change to arousal. You, if you change into that and you amp the higher frequency over, he becomes the lower frequency. Now you full of frequency. No doubt, no concept, no hesitation, no consideration. You understand? And that's how you operate out the heart. You don't operate with the mind no more. We don't use the mind no more. The mind, make, the, the thought of the mind gets you to think your way into some problems. You know, you, you, you think you scared. You think you should do this. If you know you shouldn't do what you thinking about, you always doing something you thinking about. And then five minutes later, you know you shouldn't have did it because your heart tells you I shouldn't even did that. So who are you choosing to let control your vessel? The vessel needs to be controlled by no other than the lion heart. All right? The lion heart. I am you and it will be a part two.